Good evening, Broncos, to tonight's game. I would like to thank you all for coming out and watching this here with us. Tonight, it is going to be me, Spencer Schofield, with Aiden Bullerand. And so, Aiden, what do you think about tonight's game? Tonight should be a great matchup between these two teams. Um, the Broncos' final home game. Gateway coming to this game coming to the ranch to play the Broncos on their senior night. Yeah, I definitely think that with the Gateway Panthers coming over here tonight, do you think that tonight would be a different game from the last one that we just had last week? The Broncos' last home game? Yes. Um, I think the Broncos are definitely going to change a lot of the game planning that they had last week. You know, they tried establishing a run game. They couldn't really get that. They also tried establishing an air game, passing game didn't really work out so maybe this week they figured out a happy medium between the two yeah I can definitely hope that this week or this or tonight's game is going to be much better than what we had last time and also thank you guys for coming out beautiful night tonight although we do have a little bit of rain here we may have a rain delay we do not know yet yeah tonight's forecast is a high of 75 with a low of 70 and a 70 percent chance of rain yeah definitely a high chance of rain and, uh, yeah, it looks like the game is just about to start here. The Broncos are heading out. And look at that. Can you believe it? There are the Broncos right there getting ready to get on to another game tonight. All right, so looks like our Panthers are also getting ready downfield here. We've got our Broncos on the sidelines. And our cheerleaders getting ready to perform their dances for tonight's game. What do you think about the atmosphere of tonight's game, Aiden? I mean, definitely a great atmosphere like how it has always been at the ranch. Um, the, the home crowd comes and brings up the energy for the Broncos. I believe the Broncos will be receiving, so they will be kicking off at half. Yep. But incredible game from Saunders yes. last, last week. Very good game from him and our other Broncos as well. Let's hope that uh, number 11 over here doesn't get targeted again. <laughs> Let's hope that Dargan doesn't get targeted like he did last game. Call that was rough. Night. Yeah, it was. Yeah, let's also hope that we have a good game tonight, especially with... It being our seniors' last home game. Yeah. Seniors last home game. We got to show off for him. Show off for the ranch. Oh, yes And it looks like the Broncos are just about ready to receive this ball Ooh. Ooh. Squib. Yep, another squib kick. Oh Right through his hands just missed that one. Yep And it seems on the 30 or 20 29 like. Yeah, right around, I would say, the 29-yard line is where they were. Hold on. Oh, no, that's around the 16th. I was looking at the wrong one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it seems like the Broncos are going to be starting around the 15-yard line. In their own red zone. Yep. Seems like they will be starting their rush. Aiden George is starting tonight. Ooh. Definitely seems like we may have some good plays here. Yeah. And so, uh, what do you think about this crowd out here? Definitely uh, pack the ranch, as they were saying. Yeah. Kind of like last week's game. They've always packed the ranch. You saw their first home game. The home crowd came out. Ooh. Oh, almost a great catch by the Broncos. Unfortunately, it was just missed. Would have put them in great field position, taking up half the field. Yeah, unfortunately, Rodgers over there was not able to get that ball just a tad bit in front of it, as we just saw. Looks like the Broncos are getting lined up again, getting ready for another push. Let's hope they're able to get some yardage. Ooh, ooh Aiden keeps that one. Oh, ooh, breaks that. Breaks the tackle. Ooh. Brought down around the line of scrimmage, I would say. Yeah, right around the line of scrimmage. They were just brought down again. Ooh, going back about two yards. 
third and yep, twelve. Third yeah, and twelve. Mm -hmm. You going in the air for this one, or are you trying to trying to run it? For this one, uh, since we've already just seen how they uh, handle running plays, I would definitely try and run it. But if there is no other way to get it down across the field, I would definitely say on the fourth, either kick it and send it off, Ooh. or to throw it. Oh, Great perfect catch! catch. Just Ooh. past that second line right there, and we are going to have a Bronco down. first down. Great. Great, great catch. Yeah, very great catch and a very good night, as we've seen, Aiden. Definitely uh, on pace. Yes, very much on pace. As we can see, the Broncos are definitely having a little bit of a change since last week's game. Definitely, definitely. Looks like everyone's around a little bit more happier. Ooh, nice run. Ooh. Yep. Ooh, piling right through them. Saying gain of four or gain of three? Yep. For a second of five? Ooh, no, it is five. a gain of five yards. Ooh, nice little run play right there. Yeah, very good run play from the Broncos. Let's hope to get it going a little, uh, a little more. Getting that first down again. They just have to keep pushing through. Keep the momentum. Yep. They keep that momentum going. They could soon get a touchdown. Definitely. Bring that score up. Can you hear the band playing right now? Yeah. This band is just doing amazing out here Ooh. tonight. Ooh. 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 Misses that one. Ooh. Oh. Nice Number four, Pure Isaiah got taken out of the game, as we just saw. Tackled straight down. It's a nice little game. Yeah. It's a little, little game of yards. But still, that was definitely a great tackle that was brought out by the Panthers. Definitely. It was just a gain of one? Yeah, it was a gain of one yards. Huh. Ooh, Aiden in the air. Ooh. Oh. oh. Fumble from the Broncos. Can you believe it? Just out of his hands. Yes, just out of his hands, unfortunately for them. Oh, and it seems that the special team has come out, and it looks like they are going to possibly try and kick that ball. Punt it away. Mm-hmm. I would honestly go for Yeah. fourth down conversion. Yeah, getting that conversion on the fourth down will definitely be a smart play here since it's just the start of the game. You don't want to tire out your guys too quick. Because if you do so, we may have end up we may end up with a game just like last ones, with them being too tired. Yeah, but you saw Aiden take that early shot down the field. Yeah. And most of their plays, this, this, what is it called? This sequence have been pass plays. Yes, they have. Oh, just and just out. Yeah, just out. Or a little more than just out, but yeah, know, <laughs> out on that kick. But yeah, it seems that our Broncos are getting ready to go on the defense against these Panthers. And what do you expect from the Panthers this game as they're coming into our ranch, you could say? Well, you saw last week our defense, you know, started picking things up at the end of the game, started cleaning up the weaknesses that were exploited. Yeah. Some would say. But I feel like, you know, they had they had their rest, so they're going to have that energy. Yeah, definitely. I feel like the Panthers in this game are definitely going to try their best, and so are our Broncos over here in the ranch. I really, really hope that we are able to see some good game from Broncos and Panthers tonight. They want a fun game a out here. Nice little pile. Ooh. Gain of three, four on that one. Yeah, gain of three yards there. Nice little, nice little run. Yep, good little run from the uh, from the Panthers, and it also seems that our cheerleaders out here are very enthusiastic about tonight. And I would be too. Final final time to show it to the home crowd. Yeah, final game or final home game final for the Broncos, game, yeah. <laughs> and they definitely want to put on their best performance for all these people out here in the crowd. And. Here go the Broncos. Ooh. 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 Slipped right, right through them. He slipped through and went back. Yep. And a flag on the play. Oh. A flag was made. Yeah. 
in the backfield. Apparently. Ooh, a flag on Gateway. Yeah. The Panthers. Oof. Oh my goodness, that is unfortunate for the Panthers that they got that penalty because it is sending them very far back down the field. Around 10 yards, right? Oh, yes. Long distance away. Ooh. 20. Yeah, second and 22. That is incredible, Aiden. That one flag on the play caused them to go back from being 2 and 7 to 2 and 22. Can you believe that? It's a loss of 15 on that one. Yeah. Or 25. No, 15, yeah. Yeah, 15. Get the math right. <laughs> Ooh, nice little run. Del Tor. Gain of maybe two. Yeah. One. Gain of one yard Gain of from one the on Panthers. So, third and 21. Yeah, third and 21 With for the Panthers. Oh no, third and 19 for the Panthers. Looks like our Broncos are waiting out there for the Panthers are discussing their next play. Little huddle going on? Yeah. All right, so looks like the Panthers and the Broncos are getting ready to go at it again. Ooh, a quick pass. Nice catch from number eight on the Panthers. Ooh, and number two with the takedown. Nice little pass to Yasmin Mims. Yep, and thankfully to Seth out there, we were able to get that takedown. Broncos defense doing it all. Oh, yes, they are. Playing great defense tonight. Yeah, they have definitely improved as we have just seen here, folks. And if you were Co Coach George in this instance, how would you talk to your team if you wanted them to do a good defense play like this? Just tell them keep. they know what works. They know the best of their abilities, just work to that. Yeah, I would definitely agree to that. This crowd is definitely waiting for a really good game out here tonight again. Panthers will kick what? Ooh. Timeout? Oh, yep. Looks like Gateway has taken their first timeout of the game. If you're Gateway... If you're a gateways coach, what are you telling your team right now? I would be telling my team, hey guys, don't get these flags on the play because of the fact that we just saw that flag they got needed to make up, which is a very hard to make it up, especially for high school teams because of how competitive both sides are and how it's hard to get the ball from one side of the field to the other. Because you have a lot of people that are around the same skill as you or around, you know, the same height, same everything. All that matters. Mm -hmm. And so it would be harder for you to get that ball. Yeah. And it looks like we are going to be having two great plays from these teams tonight. And Aiden, if you were Coach George and you wanted to make sure that their offense was doing good, what would you say to them? Tell my offense? Yes. You know, just because it didn't work out last time got to forgive and forget. Yeah. Because they know what works. Yeah, they passing definitely was, know what works. The passing was working. Yeah, the passing was... And the run plays were working. Yes. They have definitely improved in those areas also. Mm -hmm. And it looks like the Broncos are just kind of turning into a better team as it is every single year. As opposed from last year. second year? Yes, yeah, second year team. Still definitely a new team out here. Mm -hmm. But we are improving fast. The experience... Yes, that is what these Broncos need. They 100% need that experience to be able to play better every other game. The Broncos are getting ready. Oh, and it looks like Gateway Panthers went for a kick out there. Oh, the ball's going to stop. Yeah, around 21, 22 yard line. 
Broncos offense coming out there. Yep. Looks like they're getting ready to get through those defenses. Yeah, they saw what worked last time. Yeah. So definitely uh, use what they learned on the last line drive out. Yeah. We definitely want to see these Broncos powering through this defense because we want to make sure that they are able to get the score they always wanted to get. Aiden with a with a quick pass to Dargan or Edwards. Edwards, my bad. Rogers. To Rogers, yes. My bad. And there was a flag on that play? Yep. There's a flag on that one. Yep, another flag on play. Was it on the Broncos? Yeah, it, the flag on the play was towards the Broncos. No, it was on the Panthers. Yeah. Yeah, we got five minutes okay. left in this first quarter. And it looks like no points have been earned yet. No one has really gotten close to these uh, field goals. You know? Haven't you noticed that? Everything's been around, like, the center. Yeah. There hasn't really been any plays made deep in the field. Haven't seen any red zone plays already. So we just got to wait for this. A little run. Run going. Ooh. Broncos were taken down again. Did they gain or lose on that play? Yeah, definitely. These Broncos are I've we've noticed that these Broncos are having a little bit of a hard time trying to get past this defense, but they are definitely able to adapt to the situation. Mm -hmm. We've seen them do it before and we know they can do it again. Definitely. Aiden. Ooh, not, um, Aiden ooh, it looks like they're going to be doing a running play. Keeps that, ooh. Number one, uh, Aiden Cooper on that tackle right there out there on the midfield. And Aiden tackles Aiden. Yeah. <laughs> can you believe it? And Aiden, Aiden tackles Aiden, announced by Aiden. Yeah. <laughs> Seems like it's an aid inception out here. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, third and nine for the Broncos. Not a lot of yards gained here. All right, let's see if they're able to make it up this next play. Oh, number three. Throws it over to number one. And it looks like he is going out not too far away. Would, would you go for it on this one? For, um, on, on like a fourth and one? Oh, yes. Gladly. Getting that one foot would be amazing. Oh, fourth and two. Uh, fourth and two, yes. I would definitely I would definitely run it. I'd go for it. Yep, I would 100% go for and it. It looks like they are going to go for it. Yep. Offense it's fourth and out. one, fourth and two, and we are. you just got to push right through. That's three feet right there. Because it won't be in bad field position. No. That is a very good field position to be in. That one yard is going to be super easy to make up. Ooh. Oh, will he make it? Two Saunders. Nope. Too far. Oh! First down Broncos for the Broncos. Woo! Good Great. job, Broncos. And it looks Great like... outside pass from Aiden to oh. Saunders. Oh, yes. A very great pass to Saunders. And we are going to have a first and ten for the Broncos. And it looks like we are moving on down the field. Just past the four-minute mark in this first quarter. Yep. Definitely a big change that we've already seen. What do you think about it, Aiden? Definitely. The Broncos have momentum this time. Yes. Keeping their energy up, playing in the home crowd on your senior night. Yep. That momentum is everything in football. Ooh. Aiden Ooh. juked him. Ooh. Number three running down the field, taking many guys at once, trying to bring him down. But he was able to make... Gain of one. No, right on the line of scrimmage. Just saved. No yards lost, no yards gained. Second and ten. Yep, second and ten. On the 47. 
And it looks like these, these Panthers are definitely putting up a fight. They are not letting these Broncos have it easy. Ooh, Ooh let's see. Ooh. Oh. Did he get picked? Intercepted? Nope. Oh. It was an interception it by the was Panthers. Intercepted yep. By number 12. Yep. Goldston? Yep. Goldston with the interception out there. Less than three minutes left in the first quarter. 0-0. Zero, zero. Definitely not a lot of action going on tonight. Because we've seen these Broncos and the Panthers already going back and forth with not a lot of change. Mm -hmm. You've got to start it in your own 12. Yep. That's a lot of field to make up. Oh, yes. That is almost 100 yards they have to make up there. Yep. Can you believe it? They've got to start all the way back there. A little run. Brought back. Oh. Looks like he went back about two yards there. Yep, loss of two yards. And it looks like it's going to be a 2-12 and 12 play for the Panthers. With two minutes and 30 seconds left. Yep. <laughs> and it looks like the score is still going to be 0-0. Zero, zero. We may actually end out the first quarter with a 0-0 zero, zero play. You mean score? Yeah. 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 But yeah, definitely major improvements from our side. Ooh. Oh! Interception. Did he? Did he get it? Or did he get? It? <laughs> number four, number nineteen out there, brushing oh. it off. Uh, Giovanni out there, brushing that right off. He almost got that one. Yes, he almost, he almost did. He almost intercepted that ball right from the... Would have put them in great field position. Yes, that was almost a perfect field position for them where they could have possibly gotten themselves the first touchdown of the game before the first quarter ends. Just two minutes left. Oh, two minutes and two seconds left. My bad. Run. A little run play. Ooh. Brought back. Ooh. Loss of two more. Again, number 19, Jamez Giovanni going in with those tackles, getting those Panthers back into place, setting them back even further. We are definitely seeing a major increase in the Broncos' defense this game. Broncos' defense, great tonight. Yeah, we cannot mention it enough. Their defense has been getting so much better over the past year. As you've seen from different uh, non-home games and our other two home games that we've had here. Definitely their defense is getting much better. To kick off that deep inside your own flag. Yeah, definitely kicking off that deep is going to be very bad for the Panthers. Due to the fact that it gives Broncos a higher chance, actually, of getting their first touchdown. Fourth and 13. With one minute and 11 seconds left in the game. Hmm. Seems that the Panthers had a teammate switch going on out there. A little substitution going. Yep. Oh, oh. Ooh. Oh. Put the Broncos in great position right there. Yep. Panthers lost even more yards on that play. No, they pick it up right there. Oh, they did? They'll pick it up. Oh, it's an incomplete pass. Yeah. Seems like... Yeah, it was a fake... Uh, fake play, or... Trick play, right? Yeah, it was a jerk play. Mm -hmm. And it looks like they're heading back out again. And it seems. Broncos great field position over here. Yes, amazing field position. On Gateways 5. Ooh. 
Ooh. Ooh. Number 11, uh, Dargan taken down again and brought back a little bit. Second and goal. Oh yeah. They've been in goal. They were first and goal. Now second and goal. Yeah. These Broncos are definitely going to have to get very creative with these next two plays that they have. They need to make sure they are able to get that field goal. Definitely take advantage of the opportunity. They yes. Were given. I would put full effort into this, and I would not spare a single second. Fifteen seconds left. Let's see if these Broncos are able to get their first touchdown. Oh, flag on play. Ooh. A touchdown, but there were two Ooh. flags on that play. Yep, there was a flag thrown on, down on that play. Ooh, triple penalty, penalty markers. Wow. Definitely a cool. It was a great play, though. Yes, it was a very good play by the Broncos. Unfortunately, though, there were three penalty markers that were thrown out. And. See if any of them cancel out. Yeah. Well, nope. Oh. I got pushed back. Penalty on the Broncos, unfortunately. It looks like they're going back even further. With three seconds left in this game. Holding call on the Broncos. Very unfortunate, because they could have had very first touchdown right there. And it looks like we are going to end the game with a score of 0-0 zero, zero on the... Uh, end the quarter? End the quarter, yes. <laughs> like and the game ended? No, 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 no. Ooh. Ooh. Nope, just shy of him. Overthrew him just a little bit. Yep. And that will bring us to the end of the first quarter. Yep, end of the first quarter. We are going to have a score ending out with 0-0. Zero, zero. Looks like we are going to be moving on towards the second quarter. What did you like about the Broncos this quarter? The Broncos this quarter, I would definitely say um, their defense. Still, cannot mention it enough. Enough, enough. You cannot mention it enough. These Broncos and their defense have just been getting greater and greater. And also with the shot that they had... Uh, getting that first and goal where they could have made an awesome play, but unfortunately they had a uh, they had many flags down on the play. And uh, unfortunately that holding play got called on them, and they had to go back, and they were not able to secure that touchdown. But still, Broncos, very good effort from them tonight. Mm -hmm. And now what are your opinions on the game, Aiden? Broncos defense doing it all. And uh, Aiden, what do you think about the uh, the Panthers playing tonight? Oh, the Panthers, they've been playing pretty good. They're just penalties. A lot of penalties. A lot of penalties from the Panthers. Yeah. But definitely notice also, the penalty plays. Also penalties from the Broncos. Yeah, definitely. It seems a lot like a change. The Broncos have been definitely getting a lot less penalties. Ooh, Aiden and the, ooh. Ooh, touchdown. Right to... Touchdown to the Panthers. Dargan. Oh, no. Touchdown to the Broncos. Nice little touchdown to Dargan from Aiden. Good Dargan. job to the Broncos on the first touchdown of the game in the second quarter. Can you believe it, Aiden? We have already gotten a touchdown. That is absolutely incredible from the Broncos. Great read from Aiden. Yes. See his open man out. We have gotten this first touchdown of the game. 11 minutes, 49 seconds right in. No time wasted. Straight in for that touchdown. Amazing play from the Broncos. And we are going to head for that one-point conversion. Let's hope they're able to hit it. Ooh. And it Great looks like kick. it's solid. Looks like we are going to get that one-point conversion. We are going to have 7-0. to zero. That is incredible, Aiden. Can you believe it? These Broncos scoring this early in the game. Broncos. <laughs> Go Broncos. Go Broncos. Yeah, definitely much better game than last time. And I will say, looks like our Broncos are also performing better too. Looks like they were trained much better this time around. And it looks like we may have a game-changing game. Game-changing game play. 
You never know. Come on. Game train. Game changing. <laughs> you know, it gives it gives the Panthers something to something to look at. Look at the scoreboard. Yeah. Want to come back? But let's hope these Broncos are able to continue making these touchdowns tonight, because it seems like their energy is high and it looks like they are in a good shape. And here goes the Broncos for that kick. Ooh, really great kick on the play. Ooh, oh, all the way back there. Ooh. Brought down at around... But around the 13 to 14 yard line. Yeah. 11.39. Definitely no time being wasted from either team. Trying to get as many plays as they can in a very timely manner. Ooh, 20 yard line, exactly. Looks like the line of scrimmage will be right there. So if you were the Panthers in this situation where the Broncos had already gotten a point, what would you be telling your team? You know, there's time left in the game. There's yeah. Just got to take it one play at a time, one drive at a time. Yeah, I definitely feel like these Panthers are definitely going to have to take it one drive at a time. I 100% agree with you. But definitely these Broncos are going to have to start pushing it towards getting more and more points. Keep the momentum that they had last drive. Yes. If they keep that momentum going, they will more than definitely get that next touchdown that they want. 11.20 left in the game. And it looks like the Broncos doing good. It looks like... Second the, and ten for the Panthers. Yeah, second and ten for them. The crowd tonight definitely pleased with the Broncos' play. We have our band over here playing their beautiful pieces. And we have the cheerleaders down here supporting our Broncos and entertaining our fans. Something I realized is the Panthers' visitor side, there's a lot less people than the other teams have brought. Yeah. A lot less fans have come out to support the Panthers than they have for... When Liberty was out, yes. the Liberty fans came out. And when, last week when, hmm, who was it? Wales? Was it Lake Wales? No, it was Auburndale. Oh, Auburndale. Oh, yes, last mistake. week was Auburndale. Okay, yeah, when Auburndale, Auburndale brought a lot of fans out. Yes, there was definitely a full, there was definitely a full area out there. And as well as the Panthers have brought their band out this tonight. Oh, looks like a bad play that was just from the Panthers. They are at third and eleven, the thirteen yard line. It's fourth De and eleven. Oh, fourth and eleven now. Pretty sure. Oh yeah, it's fourth and eleven. <laughs> Taking the special teams out. Yep, special teams are coming out, getting ready for that ball to be traveling across the field. And if these Broncos are able to secure a very, very, very close point towards that field, uh, towards that field goal again, that would be really awesome, wouldn't it, Aiden? Yep, really would. But it seems like the Broncos' offense is going to be out there a lot earlier than they thought they would be. Yeah, you can definitely notice that. Kick around the 45. 45. Yeah, 45-yard line. <laughs> Looks like the Broncos will be starting off from there with a first and ten. Right about midfield. Yep. Just about midfield, actually. Five yards away. Broncos. Yeah, definitely. These Broncos, they're going to have to push that momentum this time around. No, but keep the momentum they had. Yeah, keep it and push it to be even stronger. Definitely. You always want to reach for something higher. Yeah. Crowd is definitely amused with our game tonight. And as we've seen out there, actually, it looks like the Panthers flag team is out there. You see that? Yeah, but, ooh, how much is it off? Yep, we have the Panthers cheerleaders over there cheering on their team and their fans that came out tonight for this game. And also, Aiden, even though there was a rain chance tonight still, this game is very beautiful. A nice Friday night. Mm-hmm. No rain. 
and uh, clear sky. Second and eight. So a gain of two on that one. Yep. Oh, looks like the Panthers are going to get a flag, and that is going to be offside. So the Broncos are moving up. The penalties are killing. The yes, Panthers. the Panthers, man. They are getting penalties left, right, and center, and it is damaging their plays. But it is heavily supporting the Broncos. Aiden goes in the air. Oh, let's see. Ooh. Oh, touchdown from the Broncos. Amazing play by Odom. Amazing play. It's to Rodgers. That was Rodgers. To Edward Rodgers. That was Aiden not Edward. Rogers. No yeah, way. That was Edward? That was number one. Oh, yeah, that was number one. Oh, yeah, Edward. <laughs> Accidentally said number zero there. I'm sorry, folks. Very excited for these Broncos as they got another touchdown. Can you believe it, Aiden? They are keeping up this momentum. The passing game is doing it for the Broncos. Oh, yes. It is definitely doing it for the Broncos, and they're heading for another one-point conversion with nine minutes and seven seconds left in this game. I mean, last Or not this game, the second quarter. I am just too kick excited. Kick is 14 nothing. Yep, kick is... Yeah. Oh. Offside. Oh, offsides on the Panthers. Oof. <laughs> but yeah, definitely. These Broncos have just been pushing through it tonight. It is just incredible. Broncos definitely have worked on their passing game. Oh, yes. Definitely been working on their passing game. And I would say it has also been a very, very, very fun time being here. Mm -hmm. You know? With all these people out here enjoying the game, all those delicious snacks they got at the concession stand. Man, this must be one good game. Support the Broncos. Yeah. And the pass. And supporting and our seniors on the senior night. Yeah. And it looks like the one-point conversion was good, and we're going to have nine minutes and second seconds left in this second quarter <laughs> with the Broncos having 14 points and the Panthers having zero. Definitely seeing greater plays tonight. And now, with these two touchdowns already in play, Aiden, what would you be telling the Panthers right now? What would you be telling their team? Don't let it get to you. You still, you still have around a half and I mean they got a whole nother half of football to play yeah they, they still have a whole nother half of the game and it could definitely change but it can definitely uh, kill your mood yes it can definitely will if you're not able to get those you know those touchdowns that you desire it just it brings you down a lot and we just gotta hope or the Panthers have to hope that they will be able to get this touchdowns and it looks like Broncos kicking out. Great kick. Pick up and it looks oh definitely rushing it down. Gain of, gain of looks like the Panthers will be stopping around the 21-22 yard line. It's gonna be first and ten for the Panthers. Just below nine minutes left. Yeah, so what would you be telling the Broncos right now, Aiden? Just keep the momentum that they've been gaining. They're definitely feeding off the crowd tonight. Oh, yes, definitely. The, the energy that is coming from this crowd has just been incredible tonight. With these two touchdowns, the crowd being super happy about this, and also the cheerleaders doing extremely well tonight as well. It seems like tonight may be that turnaround game for the Broncos. Good football. Good football being played tonight. Yeah, definitely. Oh, yep, Broncos starting on 22. It looks like... Oh! Was that one? Oh! Did they fumble? Yeah, it was a fumble. He dropped the ball when he was on the ground. So he was brought down, then he dropped the ball. Yeah, definitely the Panthers tonight have just been... Ooh! Timeout by Ooh, Gateway. Yeah, another timeout by Gateway. That is incredible. Can you believe it? Gateway has already used two, two of their timeouts. And it's only the second quarter. They get three more timeouts. Mm-hmm. They've already used two. Well, they got three more at the, uh, when half comes back. Yeah. But still, that's they've already used their two or three. They have one more. Yeah. For this quarter. 
Or yep. for this half? Yeah, for this half of the game, yeah. Good. But yeah, definitely, they still have one more. Yeah, they have one more left, and we still have eight minutes. The Broncos That's a... have yet to use a timeout. Yeah, they still have yet to use one. That is incredible. These Broncos are definitely putting it out there tonight, and it seems like Coach George is very, very happy. Might be the fact that it's their final home game of the season. Yeah. They want to show out to the crowd. They want to show off and do things really well. They want to show that they are the top dog, you could say. Looks like Panthers are heading out. Number 15 with the throw. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh! Ooh. Oh, fumble. Almost picked off on that one. Yeah. Incomplete pass. Incomplete pass from the Panthers. And it looks like they are heading right back to where they just were. That was incredible. That could have been a very good advantage for the Panthers right there, as we just saw. Could have been a very good gain on that one. Yes, very good gain. But unfortunately, that was an incomplete pass, and the Panthers are just going to have to go back to where they just were. Third and 13. Yep, third and 13 with 840 left in the game. Number 24 Ooh. running down the field with the football. Pushed Ooh. out around. Yep. Pushed right out of bounds around 28, 29 yard line. So a gain of like five. Oh yeah. 29 yard line. And it looks like it's going to be four and three. Four and three, ooh. Yeah, ooh, very close. Would you go for it? If you're a gateway, are you going for this one? Yes. It is still a very close call, and they, and you would, and you could very much make that. But also, they have to watch out for Broncos defense because they could stop them very quickly if they were to get a hand of the situation. Nope, they're gonna kick it. Oh, and it looks like they're gonna kick it. Ooh. 41. Yeah, getting that ball right around the 41 yard line. Right around midfield? Oh, no, 42 yard line. 42. Just past midfield. And yes, definitely, this game has been amazing from both sides. I would say the Broncos. Broncos offense firing on all cylinders tonight. Yes, their their offense has been pushing it to the max, just 100%. They are trying their very hardest to get those touchdowns, and it has worked, as we've already seen. They've already made two whole touchdowns just in the second quarter alone. Passing play works. Yep. Ooh, Aiden goes in the air. Oh, oh, oh. Saunders barely, barely missed that one. Yeah. Right in his hands. Just out. Yep, just out of his hands. That would have been a very impressive play. That would have been a very great gain and possibly a touchdown. Yes, that could have possibly been another touchdown for the Broncos right there. Not even a minute later. And that would have been another touchdown. That would have been three in one minute. Well, with the clock running down, of course. Because the last time they had a touchdown was at 9.07. Yes. And they had... Yeah. Really? Yes, they had two touchdowns already within... The running clock's minute. Yes. It is incredible. So the Broncos. Yes. The Broncos are definitely powering through this game. And let's see. Are they able to redo what they just did? Nope. Aiden Looks like they're going for a running play. Ooh. Ooh dragged back. Did he cross the line before he yep. dropped? Dragged back by number 92. I think he gained like two on that one. No, it was 90. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And it gain of one. Yep, gain of one yard. Second and nine. Mm hmm. On the 43. Yep, 740 left in this game, 14 to zero. A third down, my bad. Yep. <laughs> I was looking at the scoreboard. All right, here we go. Broncos with the throw. Oh, let's see. Are they able to successfully get this throw? Oh, successful pass. 
Well, the Broncos, Broncos with another third touchdown. touchdown. Third touchdown of the night. Woo! 20 to 0. Can you believe it, Aiden? Another touchdown from the Broncos. Great Three goal. in the second quarter. Three touchdowns in the second quarter. The Can game you believe it? Is it for the Broncos? Oh yes, definitely the tonight. Game. Amazing. Amazing passing play from the Broncos. And it looks like they may actually have a chance at winning this game. Even from the second quarter, we have seen major improvements from their team. If they're able to keep this momentum all the way through the game, oh my goodness, this will definitely be an amazing game for the Broncos. You Let's know, see, is the one-point conversion is... good? Ooh. Is that one good? And it's good. 21 to 0. 7 minutes and 22 seconds left in the second quarter. Getting some uh, some vibes of when Brindley played quarterback when you see Aiden. Yes. Definitely. Whew. These Broncos are just pushing it insanely tonight. Very good last home game that they're having tonight. Definitely putting on a show for the crowd, our cheerleaders, and for the people that are going to be watching this. Broncos offense is amazing tonight. Oh, yes. The passing game. They have just been beautiful, doing, yes. Beautiful passing game. Incredible. Just absolutely amazing tonight. Who would have known? All we needed was a little bit of a, a little bit of a darker sky. May have to. Cheerleaders throwing out some wood. What is that, gold football? Yep. The Broncos will kick it off. And let's see where these Panthers will actually end up. Ooh, Ooh, very good very kick nice all the way out there. Picked up around the five. Yep. Coming down. To oh, the, uh, oh, flag on play. Flag on that one. Run the 16. 16, 17. Yeah. Flag on that one. Oh wow. And it Broncos looks like the crowd definitely going crazy. It looks right like the now. cheerleaders are currently throwing golden footballs into the crowd for people to collect. <laughs> Definitely something for these Bronco fans to get entertained about and to keep them hyped up for this game. Oh yeah, and here we go. Oh, very, very horrible start for the, for for the, the Panthers. Panthers. Whew. Starting all the way back there. Back at their 10, right? Oh yeah, all the way back at that 10. That is incredible. The Broncos were able to bring them out that far away. Oh, on their eight. On their eight. Oh, 92 yards to get a touchdown. For the Panthers, I would definitely have to say go for passing plays. Just get that ball away from your goal because the Broncos, if they're able to get that defense on them, they will be able to make another easy touchdown. Ooh. Ooh. The line of scrimmage. Yeah, a see. flag on that one. Oh, yeah, a flag. A lot of flags tonight. Yes, a lot of flags. A lot of flags, a lot of great plays, a lot of people, a lot of everything. A lot of yards, too. Yes. A lot of air yards. <laughs> yes. A lot of yards that need to be made up. Oof. Unsportsmanlike on the Broncos? Yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, the Broncos' defense had gotten a penalty, and it is going to be, uh, yep, and the Panthers are going to be getting a first and ten. So, Aiden, this is one of the times where the Panthers could possibly make things up if you were to, you know, push them hard enough. I definitely see that there could be some, there could be some, Good plays played out here. Oh, that ball was just thrown out of there. What do you think about that, Aiden? Just thrown right out. <laughs> I don't know what to say on that one. <laughs> <laughs> that ball was just thrown right out of there. Right no, to his bench. Yep. No targets open to throw to. And uh, you don't want to get hit. You just get that ball out of there. Get out as fast as you can. Yep. All right, let's see what these Panthers have. Oh, 
Everyone's lined up and they are ready to go. Oh, Ooh, flag, flag on play. Offside, maybe? Or false start. Let's see. Ooh, false, false start. start from the Panthers. And it looks like they are going to be losing some yards. The penalties are really killing the Panthers. <laughs> yes, 100%. These the penalties. Broncos got a penalty called on them. Yep. They, they gained yards, and now they just lost them. Yep. <laughs> Two and fifteen. Can you believe it? Penalties have just been thrown this game left, right, and center. Hmm. Another run. Oh, looks like they're going for another running play. Number nineteen, twenty-four, and two taking down twenty-four from the Panthers. Cross the line of scrimmage, so Yep. Gain of me couple yards on that one yeah so it seems oh. oh wow no not even past it yet they're still three and eleven with six minutes left yep six minutes left in the game and 21 to zero in the half not the game no <laughs> man i am just a bit too excited for these broncos because the fact that they are just doing so well tonight there's so much to be excited about yes it's hard to get things right when you're so excited you know Looking all right looks like the pan oh oh oh, oh that could have been an interception from the broncos unfortunately that ball was released from his hands when he was on the ground man that would have been an amazing play from the Broncos, and that could have secured another touchdown in the second quarter. Can you believe it? Four well, touchdowns. Gateway special team is coming out. They're kicking unit. Yep. Fourth and 11. Yep, fourth and 11 on the Panthers. Special team coming out, getting ready to do a kick. Let's hope these Broncos are able to get that kick and bring it as close as they can. Definitely keep the momentum that they had going. Yes. They built momentum. Yeah, Obviously, they... if you look at the board. <laughs> yes. They built momentum, and they are just... Let's hope they keep it. That is going to be on the... 35. 34-yard line. 34, yeah, my bad. Yeah, that's going to be on the 34-yard line. And it's going to be first and 10 for the Broncos. Aiden George having a great game tonight. Yes. Very great game. Three early touchdowns. Yep, three early touchdowns in the second quarter. We still have about five minutes left. And it looks like we have a timeout going on right here. Very quick timeout, you could say. And so if you were the Panthers again, and with the Broncos getting a third touchdown what would you say to your Panthers don't get into your head yeah don't let it get to you just just continue to play you know they have another half yeah but I would definitely say though those scores for the Broncos are a huge morale boost and it will push them to do more Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, six ah oh. unfortunately that ball was not able to stay. And it looks like the Broncos are going to be heading back to that line of scrimmage again. And hoping that we're able to get past the defense for the Panthers. Oh, Broncos going in for another play. Oh, right on his hands. Just tapped it out. Dargan's Dargan. Yep, just hit the edge of his fingers. We are on a third and ten. These Broncos have definitely got to get themselves ready. Get the momentum back. Mm-hmm. They got to get this momentum back, and they got to get it running right back in. All right, these Broncos are throwing it again. Oh, right through the defense. Getting a first down. Oh, my God. Goodness, the yards gained, gained from that play. That. Whoo, that was, that was incredible. Great. That Aiden was showed just... off the wheels on that one. Yes, he did. He got them all. Aiden is having a great game. Yes, he is. 
Oh man, first and ten for the Broncos. Can you believe it? Aiden just saved that play. That is incredible. That was a great play. He saw he saw the opening and he just took it. Yep, he saw that opening, went right through, and was pushing it all the way. Oh, another throwing play by the Broncos. Another Ooh. 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 Aiden takes the sack on that one. Yeah. Loss of round. Loss of seven yards, so it's going to be two and seventeen, or second and seventeen. Wow. Yeah. But still, even if they had that, uh, those more yards to gain, still, I believe they'll be able to make it up with that play that Aiden just made. He's having a great game. Oh yes, I feel like those yards, those eighteen yards, could definitely be made up. Definitely. With enough persistence, and enough. Uh, Enough willpower, they could definitely do it. it. Looks like our Broncos and our Panthers are getting ready to go for another shot at it. Oh, looks like it's going to be a running play. Ooh. 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 Nice, that tackle. Yeah, he broke. Oh, flag on play. Let's see what it's on now. Yep. Who is the penalty going to be on? Ooh, Ooh, penalty on the face Panthers. mask penalty on the Panthers. That is an incredible penalty for the Panthers. Penalties are killing them. Oh, That's yes. Those penalties can mean a lot for the Panthers. Oh, and would you look at that? Would you look at that? They are right at the end. Ooh, 36, and it looks like it is going to be second and one. Can you believe it? Second and one, be all because of that penalty. Wow. They went from 18 to one. All because of that face mask penalty. And let's see, are these Broncos able to get another the successful catch? Ooh. Ooh. Dumb. Oh. Couldn't hold on to that one. Nope. Oh, wait, is it set? Oh, incomplete pass, just barely. If he would have held that ball just a little bit longer, that would have been a complete pass and a lot of yards gained for the Broncos. And another first down. But these Broncos going at it again. Three and one. Let's hope. Are they able to get this one yard to get that first down? I'll do a little running play. Yep. I would 100% do a running play. Like, oh, yep. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh. Wow. Number four, Pierre Isaiah going out there and pushing it through, getting even more yards than what we had expected for them to get because there was a massive hole inside the defense for the Panthers. That was incredible. Absolutely a huge hole. It through. Yeah, just a huge hole left open for the Broncos to run right on through. Two minutes and 45 seconds left in the game, 21 to 0, and another chance for the Broncos to get another touchdown. Oh, flag on play. Another one. <laughs> these flags. Yes, these flags are just flying left, right, and center tonight, Aiden. It is incredible. The yards Ooh. in these flags might be the same amount of yards the yep. Panthers have. Oh, Broncos holding, and it is going to be against them. Looks like they're going to lose around five yards. So penalties are really playing a huge part in this one. Yes. Penalties have played a massive part in tonight's game against the Panthers. And it seems that the Panthers have definitely been taking on more penalties, as we've noticed. And the Broncos have actually been using this to their advantage. And that has allowed them to get those three touchdowns. First and 17. Mm-hmm. Two minutes and 12 seconds left. Oh, unfortunate for the Broncos. No open spots and a tackle. Looks like they were taken down right around the 40-yard line. And it, Man, these Broncos, I feel like they are starting to lose that momentum. A loss of 10 on that one. Yes. 
I feel like these Broncos are starting to lose a little bit of that momentum, but I feel like they can bring it back, though. Just get into field goal range. Yep. Take a field goal. These Broncos, second and 27. Whew. Very hard play to make up right there. Let's hope these Broncos are actually able to make it up. Ooh. Ooh another Aiden running play. Misses, breaks the, misses the tackle on that one. Ooh. And he brought out around. Yep. Looks like a lot of yards were regained. Like six or seven. No, not six or seven. They were. That was a lot more than six or seven. Pretty sure it was six or seven. Oh, one minute left in the second quarter before halftime, Aiden. The Broncos oh, seven yard will gain. Kick it off. Yeah. At halftime, because. Right. Yes. Because the Panthers kicked off first. Yeah. With 40 seconds left in this game, will these Broncos be able to get another touchdown? They are not that far off. Oh. Timeout. Timeout. By the Broncos, I assume. These Broncos have to definitely think it through. Something we like saying all the time. What 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 is Coach George telling his offense right now? Yeah, I would say Coach George is telling his offense right now to get it into gear. Be into, fast. Be yep. Fast on this one. Yeah. Be fast. Be hard. But play fair. You know, because you can't just be getting flags because that's just gonna punish your own team. Yeah. I would definitely be saying play fast, play hard. And play well. Because they're not that far off from getting another one. Yeah, and they can really do not. it. 35 seconds is more than enough time for them to get it. And th with this team's performance, I definitely think they can get another one. You yeah, know? Something about the Davenport offense, it's, it's a fast-paced offense. Yeah, they are a very fast-paced offense. And their defense has also definitely been pretty fast-paced as well. But yeah, it looks like timeout's almost over here, and it looks like the Broncos are definitely going to take a shot at it with 35 seconds left to try and get this. Ooh. Oh, unfortunately, Aiden got brought back oh. again. No. Oh! Oh, the Broncos saved the ball, and they got a first and 10. With 21 seconds left? With 21 seconds left. Were these Broncos able to get a first and 10? Let's see. Oh, first. Oh, whoo! Can you believe it? That recovery right there. That I thought he was down. I'm yeah, I thought he was down. Yeah, fourth and inches. Yeah, fourth fourth and inches. inches. Whew. Man, not a lot of distance until that first down. Not a lot of time left either. They have to hit it into high gear if they want to get this fourth touchdown in the second quarter. That being the Broncos' second timeout? Yes. They got one more? Yes, they have one more would timeout. Would you bring the field goal unit out? I think that's what they're doing. Mm -hmm. I, I would definitely bring out those those runners or those kickers. Unit. Yeah. Yeah. Take the kickers out. Get that field goal. Because mm -hmm. if they're able to secure that, uh, that kick, I would definitely say, though, I would definitely take the chance on running it because of the fact that we still have, like, 20 seconds left. That's still a lot of time to make up. How about the, field, the special teams is coming out? Yeah. So they're going to go for the field goal. Yeah, 21 seconds with the distance they have. Oh, yes, they could definitely make it. Yeah. Especially with the fact that they are on the 14-yard line right now. They could 100% make it if they tried. But I feel like they definitely put in those special teams to let their... Uh, Guys, relax. Ooh. Ooh, flag Ooh, flag on play. If the if the uh, if the Panthers got a flag on play and they get pushed back, they may have to take out their running team. The offense is coming out. Yeah, I think the offense is coming out. Oh, first and ten for the Broncos. First and goal, I think. Oh, yeah, first and goal, actually. And it looks like the Broncos may have to actually bring out their uh, offense team. Because if they do, they could definitely get another touchdown. I 100% uh, believe if they brought that offensive team out, 
they are going to get another touchdown. Believe I in the Broncos. so believe it. Believe in the Broncos. Yep. Let's hope these Broncos are able to get another touchdown with 20 seconds. But if you want to be precise for you people out there, 19.6 seconds. All right, Broncos. Let's see some magic happen. 18 seconds. Ooh. Oh, definitely pushing through. We may not actually get this one, unfortunately. Time out. Oh, two seconds left. And it looks like the third Field timeout was used. Out. Yeah, third timeout was used for the Broncos with two seconds left. Field goal unit is out there. Yep. What, do, what would that be? Uh, add 10. So 22, 21-yard kick. Yeah. 21-yard field goal attempt. Because you add 10 to... Yeah. Yeah. But it looks like they're just they're not going to do it, and they're just going to kick that ball and hope that they get right in between that field goal, and they're able to get those. Make it 24 if they get the field goal. Yeah, trying to get 24 points. Let's see. Are, is it going to be a good kick? Kick is good. And the kick is good, and it looks like it's going to be 24 to zero, ending out the first half of the game. Aiden. How do you feel about this first half of the game? Broncos definitely showing out for the final home game of the season. Great. Oh, yes, definitely. And what do you think about the Panthers? About uh, Panthers got to clean up the penalties. Oh, yes, definitely. Penalties are killing them. Yeah, these penalties are really destroying their ball game tonight. Well, that's our, that's our first half of this Broncos-Panthers game. Yeah. Not Broncos much to, up 24-0. Mm -hmm. There's Great. not really too much that you can say about it because it's just it's that impressive. Great game from Aiden. Oh, yes. Great amazing game. game from Aiden. Definitely a huge change for the Broncos. And uh, halftime just hit. So, so we'll be back at the beginning of the second half. Yeah. All right. They will be performing their 2022 show, Pirates of the Caribbean. Ryan Vargas, is your band ready?
You may now begin your competition performance.
High School Panther Pride Marching Band is under the direction of Mr. Jonathan Money. Color Guard Instructor, Ms. Katie Arujo. Drum Major is Ryan Vargas. Band Captain, Bea Carcano. Section Leaders, Brianna Wynn, Jorge Del Cruz, Courtney Myers, Alex Notar. Equipment Manager, Sebastian Moreno and Eduardo De La Cruz. Librarian is Leona Glass and the historian, Aaliyah Campo Azevedo.
Okay. Welcome back to Advent Health Field at the ranch. Your Broncos are currently leading Gateway Panthers 24 to nothing. The Broncos will kick it off to the Panthers. And yeah. I'm with, I'm back with Spencer. Yep. Schofield. 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 There you my go. Bad, <laughs> it's all right. But yeah, we are back. 12 minutes on the clock. And it looks like the Broncos are getting ready to kick that ball over to the Panthers. And off it goes. Ooh. Let's see where this ball ends up. Another great kick. Yep. Oh, <laughs> did you see him do that? He just dived right in for that ball. Mm, great effort, though. Yes. Right around the 30-yard line for the Panthers. Ooh. All right, so Aiden, since we're in the second half of the game, what would you like to see from both the teams? I'd like to see the Broncos put more points on the board. I like get our Broncos going, get the get the energy up, keep the momentum that they had in the first half. Yep. Something you need. And then what I want to see from Gateway is a lot more resistance from the defense. Yeah, definitely a little bit more resistance. Because these Broncos have definitely been able to get through them. Oh, and look at that. Bit. Gateway getting right on through. And it seems like number 24 was able to get Ishmael right on through. Cise. Yeah, was able to get right on through. Great little pass. Mm -hmm. It seems that the Broncos in their defense already have had a little bit of holes. And it looks like the Broncos are going to need to cover that up a little bit. Definitely. These pa uh, the Panthers are starting to to look around to find the holes, mm -hmm. find the gaps, find those small little gaps and use them to their advantage. Let's hope the Broncos' defense is able to close those little gaps that they're able to find. Ooh, you can see they stopped them right there, right at the line. Yep, that is perfect. You want that type of momentum. You want to stop them right then and there. You do not want them to gain any yards, and you do not want them to lose any yards. And the Broncos are doing a very good job of right. Uh, Loss of two on that one, I think. Because it was second and eight, and now it's three and two. Third, uh, three and, third third and, and ten. ten. <laughs> third and ten. My bad. Three and two. Wow. Three and two. But yeah, definitely. The Broncos with their defense are definitely holding them back right now. Ooh, number 24, uh, number 24 again with the running play, instantly stopped by the Broncos. Fourth and ten. Yeah. Can Davenport's you believe defense it? Defense is locking down, <laughs> as they have been all night. Yes, they have just been locking down this field. They have not let the Panthers get far at all, especially with the amount of penalties we've seen this game. Panthers have made not really a lot of yards this game though our Broncos have taken those throwing plays that we saw in the first half and just got rid of them they just got that ball through the air and they got it into that touchdown and it was just amazing that first half of the game I definitely want to see that happen again with the Broncos and uh, yeah let's hope that this this half of the game will be as good as the first half Ooh. Flag on the play. Seems there's false a flag start. on play. Ooh. False start. Ooh, offside from the Broncos. And it looks like there's going to be... Yep, it's going to be fourth and five, and then some yards are going to be lost. For they will still keep the special teams out. Yes. Seems that... Nice little kick. Yep, nice little kick. From number 35. Well, that was a good kick. Yeah. Right around the... Uh, 8, 15, 16? Yeah, right around the 15, 16 yard line. Yep, 15 yard line. Woo! First and 10 for the Broncos. Offense looking to carry the momentum they had. Yep, let's see this momentum get carried from the first half over. We definitely want to see those good plays that we had. At the end of that first, or second quarter? Yes. That was a great evading the 
baiting the tackle and then throwing it. Oh, yes. That is definitely the type of play that we want to see from our team tonight. With already nine minutes left in the third quarter, this quarter is just breezing by. Definitely. Yes, very fast quarter that we are having. Very fast three minutes right there. Oh, yeah, very, very fast. Time just flies when you have a good game. And I guess everyone that said that has been telling the truth. Ooh, Aiden Ooh. keeps that one. Here Ooh. comes the Broncos. Brought down. Ooh. Seems that the Broncos have lost five yards. And they are at second and 15 currently. 8.50 left in the game or in the third quarter. And it seems that the Broncos are actually starting to get brought back from the Panthers. And it seems that these Broncos have to start making it up a little bit more. Ooh, Aiden. Aiden keeps that one. Ooh, throws it. Ooh. 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 Oof. Incomplete pass for the Broncos. That could have been a major that could have been a major game changer for them. Especially with all those yards that could have been gained. Whew. Would definitely change field position. Oh yeah. Third and fifteenth on the Broncos. Eight twenty-three. Let's see what happens here. Ooh. Oh, Broncos oh. dropped the ball. Whew. Fourth and let's see. I think the so. Oh my goodness! Fourth, Fourth and, and twenty-three 23. for the Broncos. Whew. The penalties are starting to affect the Broncos now. The offense. Yeah. Collapsed. Mm-hmm. The first half of the game, it was the the Panthers getting all the penalties. And it seems that the Broncos are just starting that collection. Let's hope these Broncos don't have the same penalty range as those Panthers did in the first half. Oh! Drop the ball. Ooh. Is that a touchdown for a gateway? Defensive touchdown for gateway. Yep. Wow. Can you believe that? Already. Just then and there. Dropped the ball and and gave the Panthers a touchdown for six points. So don't you believe that was a little a little weird how they kinda accidentally dropped the ball back there? <laughs> yeah, definitely have to work on the snap a little bit. Yeah. All the pressure. Yeah, there was definitely a lot of pressure that was put on the Broncos right there. And so, let's hope they're able to get this extra point. Well, not the Broncos getting an extra point. I don't want the. I want the well, you don't want Gateway to get that extra point. Well, for yeah. The Broncos. But still, you, come on now. You can't just be bad about it. You can't be biased about it. Yeah, you can't be biased. Because guess what? If they win, if the. Oh, had a man coming in. Yep. But yeah, if the Panthers win this one, the Panthers win this one. If the Broncos win this one, the Broncos win this one. You know? Because that's how it works. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> it's just up to who's got more skill, who's got more patience, and who's got better running game. Honestly. Yep, trying again for that point. And let's see if that extra point they get will be another point, you know? Because they could possibly hit it outside the field or the uh, post, you know? Yep. Two-point conversion. Oh, it's two-point this time, two-point conversion. So they're going for a pass. Yep. Not going for a kick. Oh. A timeout. Okay. A lot of talking going on over with the Panthers. Early timeout for the Panthers. Oh, yeah, very early. 
And plus, it's a uh, it's a little confusing to think that uh, the Panthers are having this much conversation already as it is, and a lot of uh, thinking about how they're going to play this uh, play here for that uh, point conversion. Because they were going to go for that one point. They were going to go. For yeah, the, they were going to go for kick. that one. They and were going to go for that going kick. For two point. Yep. And now they're going trying to go for a two point. It's See. just. What are they trying to go for right now? Two yep. Point so it looks like they're gonna they're gonna solidify their choice. Yep. They're going for that two point conversion. I thought they were gonna take out the field goal unit because they called it a timeout. Yeah. Do they get it? Think so. Yep. yep. Looks like they it were able to get that two point conversion. Eight and twenty four. And it is twenty four Broncos. Eight for the Panthers. It's Kobe's numbers. Yeah. Yeah. Eight and 24. But, uh, yeah, it's going to be first and 10 for the Broncos. And Panthers is going to kick off for them. The crowd is definitely a little, a little more quiet than they were. Yeah, a little bit more quiet than they were in the first half. Cheerleaders still entertaining out there. Definitely. Mm -hmm. As we saw during halftime, our band was actually playing. And Gateway's band, too. Yeah, Gateway's band, too. They were actually out on field. Performed a little Pirates of the Caribbean, I believe. Yeah, Pirates of the Caribbean. Seven minutes and 24 seconds. Yep. Be a little crazy if it was 8.24 with... Yeah. <laughs> symbolism. I guess, some would say. Yeah, you could okay. say. But yeah, it definitely looks like the Panthers are getting that play ready right there. The Broncos are just waiting for them to... Gateway getting ready to kick it off to the Davenport Broncos. Mm -hmm. And let's see what his ball ends up. Mm -hmm. and let's hope it's a mile distance away so we're able to get much closer towards the touchdown again. What do you want to see from the Broncos this drive out? In this drive, I would definitely want to see the Broncos try and get as many yards as they can. Because... Touchback? Yeah. So they'll pick it up around 15? Or yeah, I think it's around the... Oh, 25. Yeah, 25 yard line. For My touchback. Bad. But yeah. So Aiden, what do you expect since the Broncos are, you know, they're starting to see that the Panthers are observing them and they're starting to find ways to get through them. What would you tell the Broncos right now? I would tell my team to not get into its head. Just continue to do what they did in the first half. Yeah. But also clean up, keep Aiden in the pocket for an, enough time. Yeah. Give him time to get his receivers downfield. Yeah, Aiden has definitely been a crucial part of this team, as we have seen. Ooh, oh, and there he goes, down. running down the field. Ooh, oh, first down for the Broncos. Ooh. Oh, oh man, he is just going downfield. Almost, down Almost made it to midfield. Mid that is incredible. Great gain on that one. Yes. Incredible gain from Aiden. Made it all the way almost down to midfield, and we were able to get that Broncos first down. That is incredible. Move those chains. Yeah. Definitely. Aiden. Aiden has been just pushing it tonight. But, yeah, the Broncos setting up for another run, maybe, here. Go nope, passing play. Go near, ooh. Ooh, Dargan. Ooh, ooh Dargan, with the, Dargan with the catch. Ooh. ooh. Just across the 30. Yep, just across. Yeah, just across 30. Whew. Man. 28-yard line. For first and 10. First down. Yeah, Broncos first down. They are pushing it again. They got that fast-powered offense. Yep. That momentum is coming back from the first half. Definitely. You can definitely tell. Oh, another passing play? Yes. Oh. oh. 
Incomplete pass from the Broncos. To Saunders. Yep. Just missing that pass. Second and ten on the 28 with six minutes and 19 seconds left. Mm -hmm. Broncos retaliation is coming back at the Panthers. You can definitely tell because they pushed them from uh, Bronco territory over to Panther territory very quickly as well. Field flipper. Yep. Ooh, to Dart. Or ooh. ooh, my bad. To Rogers. Yep, successful catch from Rogers. And it looks like they've not gained any yards. Oh, no, they have. They're they've around gained. Four? Yeah, three, oh, three yards. Three yards. Yep, so they are in third and seventh. And let's hope they're able to get that passing or running game down the, again, uh, down the field again and getting that first and ten. Just clock remains ticking down. Yep. Five and a half minutes left. Broncos lined up. They're ready to start playing. Flag on the play. Ooh. In the backfield. Oh. Seems to be a call on the Broncos, unfortunately. <laughs> Delay of game. Oh, yeah. So it's going to be a third and 12 for the Broncos. Oh, water break. 521 left in the game. Stay hydrated. Out oh, there. yeah, definitely. With how hard the Broncos are pushing out their offense and their defense, they want to definitely be hydrated out there. The Broncos offense has been out there a lot, even though it's a fast offense. Yes, they have been out there quite a lot. And I will definitely say that this offense has been amazing tonight. Great offense. Mm -hmm. Panthers, too, also getting a comeback touchdown as well, as we just noticed, and a two-point conversion also. Nice little defensive touchdown. Mm -hmm. That defensive touchdown was actually pretty good. You cannot lie. That was a pretty good defensive touchdown that they had. Just recovered the ball mm -hmm. in the end zone. Broncos getting lined up again as well as the Panthers. Let's see what the Broncos have in store. Oh, oh! It looks like Aiden's going to be going Ooh, down for another Aiden running more play. Yards on that one. Ooh. Ooh, a lot of yards gained from Stretched Aiden. The arm out to get as many yards as possible. Yeah, even though he was being around swarmed. the fifteen. Fifteen. Oh, wow. Even though he was being swarmed, he was able to push through all of that and get another Broncos first down. Five minutes left in the game. Right on the 15-yard line. Not that far away from another goal again. The third quarter. Aiden's been phenomenal tonight. Yeah. Definitely showing the wheels off. And also showing the arm off, too. Yeah, he's... Definitely had a very good running and th uh, throwing play this game. Complete two-way quarterback. Yeah. Ooh. Saunders with a gain of five. Yep. Seems like the Broncos definitely made some yardage on this one. Ooh, Ooh gain of seven. seven yards. Ooh. Second and three until another first and ten for the Broncos. Whew, man, this game has just been phenomenal for the Broncos. Yeah, just phenomenal. Ooh, Ooh taking that oh, running run. play. Ooh, are they in? Oh, flag on the oh. play. Oh, and he's on his feet, but there's a flag on the play. Oh, there's a flag on play. Was that flag for the Broncos? Not sure. I think so. I believe so. Yep. It, holding for the Broncos. 
but incredible for him to stay on his feet on that one. Ooh, Broncos second and 14 now. Loss of 10? Yeah, loss of 11 because oh. it was uh, second and third or it was second and three. Mm. And now it's uh, second and 14. So they lost 11 yards for that. All right, looks like they're going in for another running play. Ooh, great block. We running right down. in there. It was a great block yeah, for him, but he was brought down. He tore that wall down very quickly. He got right on through, and he is trying so hard to get that first and 10 for the Broncos. And this team has just been putting in not 100%, but 110% to try and get the best game they can. Gain a five on that one, by the way. Mm -hmm. Gain a five. Third and nine. Let's hope the Broncos are able to recover this. Ooh. Who's that, too? Ooh. Don Donto. Dan Donto. Yep. First and goal. Yep, first and goal. Three minutes and four seconds left. Yeah, if we're able to get another touchdown, that will give us 30 points. Man, can you believe it? Broncos getting <laughs> another touchdown. In it, very possible. Incredible. Yeah, it's incredible, but it's also very possible that we could be stopped also. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Looks like he was. A little dish to Rodgers on that one. Yeah. Handoff. All right, so Aiden. What do you feel like would be the most optimal play for them right now? A run play. A run play. An out, outside run play. Why do you say that, Aiden? Because it um, seems like Gateway has had a hard time covering the outside run. They, yeah. can, they can cover the inside run, but the few plays that they've gone outside for the run haven't been too good. Yeah. Second and seven left, or second and seven with around two minutes left here. And let's see if these Broncos are actually able to get another touchdown on their belt. Oh, and look at that. Number five going right in. Touchdown, Broncos. Touchdown for the Broncos. Sanders. Woo! 30-8 to eight for the Broncos. Can you believe it, folks? Great, great effort. Kick was good. Yep. 31 to 8 for the Broncos. Can you believe it? Oh, Saunders' is third touchdown of the night. Yeah. The Broncos are doing amazing out here tonight. <laughs> and, yeah, there has just been a lot of energy coming from the Broncos, the team, the cheerleaders and the crowd itself. This game has just been wonderful. Wouldn't you say? It was a great game. Yeah. It's been a great game. Very good way to show off as a, uh, you know, senior night. Close off your uh, your home season. Oh, your, yeah. Your, se your final home game of the season. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Got a word. Seems that the Broncos will be kicking it over to the Panthers. Ooh. Ooh, great kick. Very great kick. Picked off around the, that was the eight. Oh, wow. Wow, he just went right through the Broncos defense right there. 
1 minute 36 seconds remaining in this uh, quarter. And it seems that uh, the Panthers were able to get to the 40-yard line. They started all the way back out at the 5-yard line. And they got out to 40. That was an insane running play from Panthers. A lot of yards gained. Definitely. First and 10 on the 40. Mm -hmm. And let's hope this Broncos defense will cover up those holes because the Panthers are starting to see these holes again. Capitalize. Oh, Panthers stopped right, the right there. Whew. Can you believe it? They were just brought back. No mercy from the Broncos tonight. They want to make sure they win this one. Definitely. Yep. That was a loss of two yards for the Panthers, and that will leave us with second and 12. We have one minute and five seconds left in the game. Or third quarter. The minute will wind down. Yep, less than a minute left already. Oh, again, the Broncos are just not letting the Panthers get by. Definitely have closed off the gaps. Yeah. Broncos are finally starting to... As Aiden just said, the Broncos are definitely starting to close off those gaps. And I 100% agree. They're starting to see where those open areas are, and they're trying to close them up a little bit more, tighten them up. Because mm -hmm. they want to get that nice, good wall on them, and they want to make sure that they are not able to get touchdowns. Ooh. 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 Oh. Any crosses. First down for the Panthers. Number 24. Just three minutes and nine seconds left in the third quarter. Yep. Wow. Oof. Yeah. If you were... So, Aiden... If you were Coach George right now, what would you be telling your Broncos? Great effort tonight. Great plays. Great yeah. great job on offense. Great job on defense, obviously. Yeah, doing really well. Overall solid performance for my team. Yeah, I can see that. And yeah, the time has just gone out for the third quarter. Start of the fourth. Yep, starting up on the fourth quarter. Great job, though. That was, a gr that was a fast third quarter. I'm yes, that was an incredibly fast third quarter that we just had. And I felt like most of it was kind of a running clock, but still. Very fast third quarter. Very awesome third quarter as well because we were able to get another touchdown on the Broncos. And so, as a game in total, how do you think, you know, Broncos' effectiveness, uh, Panthers' effectiveness, how would you, you know, treat that as tonight? The Broncos have capitalized on the opportunities they have been given. But, as you can see, the penalties have really still played a part in the game. Yeah, these penalties have definitely affected both teams tonight. But there was a lot less penalties in that third quarter. Yeah, a lot less. <laughs> many, many less, unlike the first quarter, where it was just penalty after penalty after penalty from both sides. Mm -hmm. Ooh, going in the air for this one. A reception. Ooh. Reception to... To around... and Mims. Yeah, like 26-yard line. Oh, 27-yard line. Oh, 26. All right, yeah. So... Panthers. Let's see. 
are they able to capitalize on this opportunity? Yeah. Because they are a lot closer. They are a lot, lot closer. Instead of them normally being around the 50, 40 yard line in their own territory, they're over in Bronco territory now. Definitely much closer. Third and 14. Wow. So what are you expecting to see from our Broncos on this new defensive play? Probably close the run again. Yeah. If they keep closing that run. That's been key to everything. Closing the run game, closing the gaps, not letting them get through. Yeah. They're going in the air for the... Ooh, no, he keeps it. Oh, doing around. a running play. Oh, went out, tried to come back in, and still is out. Oh, yeah. A lot of people trying to stop that ball all at once, and it looks like... Oh, Third and they ended up where they started. <laughs> no gain, no loss. Nope. Third and 14. Ten minutes and eight seconds left in this game. Mm -hmm. Very quick fourth quarter also already. And already gone through in. a whole two minutes. That's incredible. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, very long oh, pass. Out. Oh, out. On that, out. that is out. That will not count out there due to the fact that he was he caught that ball mid-air but had his feet out of bounds try to get a little toe tap in if yep. he was on the line no but it he was, was out for that one yep it he was, was he, completely he was out he was completely out yeah <laughs> fourth and 14 i think they're going for it yeah i think they'll the only thing that they could possibly do here is kick it to be honest just get it out no they're going for it oh they're gonna run up they're gonna run a fourth down conversion yeah let's see are they able? Actually, are they actually going to be able to get past our Broncos defense tonight? Defense has been amazing. Yeah, it has. Oh, they're going for a running play. No low pass. Oh, but not enough to get Un yeah. the first down. Yeah, unfortunately, it was not enough. Not able to get past that line. Broncos picking it up in yeah. their red zone. Oh, and uh, Aiden, have you noticed that for that entire play? Uh, the Panthers actually never have uh, gotten one past the line of scrimmage. They started at the line of scrimmage, and they went back. Did you notice that? No, I did not. Yeah. They went behind their own line of scrimmage and stayed there for those four turns. Wow. That is incredible. Our Broncos defense is holding them back with no mercy. They are not going to let the Panthers even nudge full retaliation sir Wayne will come in for Aiden George Aiden George will sit after an incredible incredible three quarters of football yes very good plays from Aiden and let's hope Wayne is able to pick up on Aiden's legacy you could say brought down yep seems the Broncos have definitely lost some yards here a few yep seems like it would be yeah second and 14 on the field four yards off four yards lost yep about nine minutes left here in the fourth quarter 31 to 8 this game is going very very well for the Broncos tonight it has been all night. Yeah. Broncos set up that momentum. They've kept it. Yep, they've kept it going all game. Ever since that second quarter. Great second quarter. Oh, yes. Ooh. Ooh, good job on the Broncos for that successful catch and getting it to uh, third in inches. Rogers with another good catch. Yeah. Setting that from being second and 11. Oh! They're going to give him that first down. So it is going to be a first and 10 for the Broncos with 
just under 8 minutes and 30 seconds already. Yeah, the Panthers are definitely getting stressed out from these Broncos, overwhelming them over and over. Ooh. Oh, interception from the Panthers. Whew. That was crazy. Interception right there. It was, a good, it was a good pass, though. It was a very great pass. But, unfortunately, it was intercepted by the Panthers. Intended for Justin Saunders. Yeah. And so it seems that also the Panthers, once again, are not in their territory. They are playing in ours again. And so that puts them at a major advantage, you could say, because that's a lot less distance they need to get another touchdown. Panthers are in great field position. Yes, they have a very great field position. Less than half of the field to cover up, mm -hmm. um, around 37 yards, if we want to be exact. Yeah. But definitely, these Broncos are going to have to put on their mean faces, their big boy pants, and just get that defense right up in there. You have to hit him hard. Ooh. Oh, right on through the Broncos defense for a first and ten. Looks like the Panthers are going again in our territory. Cheerleaders getting the crowd into this one. Yep. Cheerleaders are trying to get the crowd to give all their support. Because these Broncos, they need the support, not just from the cheerleaders, but also the crowd out there. Clock will wind down. Yep. Seven minutes and 30 seconds. All right, these Broncos. Let's see their defense going on. Oh, another hole in the Bronco defense. Another hole that was found. And Broncos another defense is letting it up this quarter. Yes, they are. Ooh. Yeah, they are first and goal now. They better they better hold them back. They better hold them back. Defense is maybe a little out of energy right now yeah that defense definitely needs a little bit more support because they are just letting them through band playing yep these broncos out here had a really good Ooh. really 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 Ooh. good game Ooh. is he over the line oh he crossed the line. Ah. Uh, Second and one. Oh, my goodness. Got to play it hard. Oh, yeah. The intensity of that one. Yeah, these Broncos, if they are able to push them back, that would be amazing. These Panthers have to think very carefully about how they're going to do this. Because the Broncos do have that potential to push them back. And we have seen that many times tonight. So let's see. How are these Panthers going to handle our Broncos defense? Oh. Nope. Cross the line. Touchdown. Rushing on through. Yep. And that is touchdown another for touchdown. Gateway for the Panthers. And let's see. Since the Panthers had a little bit of a difficulty last time on deciding if they wanted to go for that extra point or the two-point conversion, what do you think they're going to try and go for this time, Aiden? I think they're going to go for the field goal. Oh. Are they going to? You, you think they're going to go for the field goal? They might go for it. I think they're going for it. No, it looks like they're... Oh, no, they're setting up for the two-point conversion. Wow. 
they want to get those, you know. They want those points. Yep, they okay, want to get as many them. points as they can. They got them. Yep. 538 left. Broncos 31. Panthers 16. The Panthers are slowly starting to catch up again. Do you yep, feel like the energy has just been, like, decaying over time from these Broncos? Uh, I feel like the momentum has shifted to the Panthers. Yeah. The Broncos have definitely lost momentum tonight. Or, not tonight, this quarter. Yeah, this quarter, they have uh -huh. lost momentum a little bit. Because they've had momentum the whole night. Yeah. But they've lost the momentum they had. They just need to push it on right through. And they just got to, you know, they got to get that game going again. Because, as we just saw, their defense... Has had a little bit of holes in them again. But yeah. Broncos heading on the field here. Getting ready to go for an offense. Broncos going to receive. Receive the kick. Yep. Obviously. Yeah, let's see. So, where do you think, after the uh, Panthers hit this ball, where do you think the Broncos will end up at? Maybe across the 20. Across the 20? Across the 20. I think the Broncos will make it across the 30. Ooh. Because they do have that. They definitely they have. They speed. Yeah, they definitely have speed. They definitely do. 30-35, 100%. Because these Broncos have just been pushing it all out tonight. And it has just been a really good game. Ooh. Oof. And it looks like the ball will be stopping. Around the 41. Yep, around 40, 41 yard line. Not a deep kick on that one. No. Not a deep kick, but still. I believe an onside kick? Yeah. First and ten for our Broncos. Yeah. The energy from our cheerleaders, our fans, and the band have not died at all. If you're Coach George, are you going to put Aiden back in? Would you put Aiden back in? Yes. I would. But he's not going back in. Yeah, I know. I would, though Continue I would... Continue the incredible game that he's had so far. Yes, because Aiden is... He is just there and he wants to be in. He wants to get those touchdowns. He has been the carrier, you could say, for our team tonight. And he has just blew the game away. But those great plays, those great running plays also. Whew, he's just been barreling through these points. Great games from the wheels. Mm-hmm. All right, Broncos setting up for another offense. First and ten. Let's see. Oh, flag, flag, on, flag play. on play immediately. False start. Offside. Oh, false start from the Broncos, unfortunately. And it seems that we're going to be pushed back by five yards, so it is going to be first and 15. Aiden looks like he's ready to go back in. Yeah, Aiden looks so ready to go back in, even just sitting on the sideline. He just, he's... <laughs> well, he's standing now. Yeah. But he is so ready to go back in and show... Continue uh, the amazing game that he's had. Yeah, he just wants to show the Panthers what is good with our team. Wayne keeps that on the tuck and run. Ooh! Very good running play from our Broncos. As they had just gotten themselves a first and ten. Again. They are just getting back at it again. Great job. Yeah. Don't you feel like that momentum is just starting to come back now? Yeah, definitely, definitely. Yeah, all these Broncos need is just a little bit of motivation, a little bit of willpower. They can go right on through. But yeah, the Broncos setting up on the 43-yard line with 5 minutes and 26 seconds left in the game.
Ooh. 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 For the Broncos. Pierre kept that one. Yeah, he did. On the run. That's another first and ten for the Broncos. The momentum has come back. Yes, it has. That momentum is 100% coming back to them. Let's hope the Broncos are able to keep this momentum all the way until they are able to get another touchdown in this last quarter. Because that would be amazing. Another touchdown. Great field position for the Broncos right now. Yes. Oh, running play from the Broncos. Oh. Brought down at the line, I think. Yep. Oh, no. Ooh. Two yards. Two yards in. Broncos gain of two yards, second and eight. Five minutes left in the game. So, Aiden, what do you expect the rest of this game to kind of look like? It was less than five minutes, so the Broncos. Broncos taking this one. Broncos taking home this one? Gotta say. Yeah. Well, five minutes is still a lot of time. The Panthers do still have time to make it up. Ooh, and it keeps that one. Yep. Keep that one. And I think they got another first. Did they cross the line? Mm. Ooh, no. They did not get a short. first and ten. They got, yep. Yard or two short. One yard. This will be third two and short. two. These Broncos are definitely going to be able to get it over this time. Let's see these Broncos. Come on, Broncos. Let's see you hit it. Oh. Ooh. Number 12. When kept it. Ooh, crosses. Oh. Right in for another Bronco. First, first down. And then some on that one. Yeah, first and then some. Can you believe it? These Broncos are starting to bring back the momentum that they had in the last two quarters. Bring back some energy. Yeah. Just push to the end. Push. First and nine on the nine. Oh, wow. Yeah, definitely. These Broncos are just holding it out tonight. Oh. Unfortunately, some yards were lost for the Broncos on that play. But I will definitely say our Broncos have had that momentum of just pushing through. Whew. Oh, defensive game way timeout. So, yeah, Aiden, with the Broncos finally getting that nudge again, you know, that nudge that they needed. The and that momentum is starting to come back. Do you think the Broncos will be able to make at least like one or two more touchdowns this game? Maybe not two, but they definitely have the ability to get one more yeah. on this drive. Or at least I would go for a field goal. Yeah. Settle for a field goal if you can't get anything more. Yeah, I definitely see how the Broncos could be getting another field goal. Just put as many points as you can on the board. Yeah. And plus one that timer gets down to around two minutes one minute it's basically just an all defense game from there because even with like one two minutes that's still more than enough time for the Panthers to get at least one or two more still because if they push it they push it hard enough because yeah. remember that's what our Broncos did oh immediate flag that a false start. Yep, false, false start on the Broncos, Broncos again. Whew. Man. They are taking it heavy this time. Yep. Oh, wow. Second and 20. That is incredible. Ooh. 
Ooh. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh. Yep. Two minutes, 50 seconds left in the game. Looks like it's going to be third. Third and 22. But yeah, Broncos are definitely pushing it as hard as they can. Although they may not be able to get it next time or this time. <laughs> I feel like they would definitely if they pushed it. Oh, Ooh. successful pass. Saunders. Oh. Saunders with a nice receipt, reception. Ooh. It's in the ooh. Oh, that counts. Does it count as a touchdown? That's a touchdown for the Broncos. That counts. 37 to 16. 37 to 16 for the Broncos. Can you believe it, folks? Another touchdown with two minutes left in this game. Can you believe it? The Broncos are just doing incredible things tonight. Incredible. Incredible game for the Broncos all around. Yes. Incredible game. These Broncos have just been barreling through. But amazing. Yes. Ooh. Oh man, these Broncos are just coming whew. out for the extra point. Yep, you're gonna try and kick for that extra point. And uh, from here, Aiden, would you consider this to kind of be more of a? Uh, of a uh, defense type play, just kind of keep those points there, not let them get any. What do you mean? Like the uh, Panthers, like the Broncos, they just play on defense most of the time now, because the fact that there's, because they may be able to get another touchdown if they work hard enough. But I'm just saying, as in like a general type thing, do you think that the Panthers are going to try extremely hard on the last two minutes that they have? I mean, you got to give it everything you got. At least do something that will carry over to the next game. Yeah, because those Panthers are definitely going to need that motivation. But a great, great senior night for the Broncos. Yeah. Great final home game to bring. Safe to say a win. Yeah. This is definitely going to be a win for the Broncos. And it's going to be a very, very good win, too. Nice to win your final, if you're a senior, your final home game. Yeah. These Broncos are definitely going to be enjoying this win. They have earned themselves. Definitely. Wasn't handed to them. Nope. All right, let's see. Is that one-point kick good? Mm. Yeah, oh, it's good. Just, just, just a barely. Over. Yeah. yeah, just barely over. It's still good. 38 to 16. Wow. Wow. Whew. These Broncos are just something else tonight. Oh, two minutes and six seconds left. Yep. If you were the coach right now yes. for the Panthers team, what would you be telling their team? Because obviously we already know there's no possible way that they could get enough points already as it is to get, you know, a win. But what would you tell your team to prepare themselves for the next game that they have? I would just tell my team to just remember it, you know. Yeah, use it as a lesson. Use it as motivation. Yeah, motivation. to the next game. Yeah, I, could, I agree with that. And then if I'm Coach George, I'm telling the Broncos to keep it up. Keep up the effort. Keep up the drives. Keep up everything. Yeah. Because still, that defense should be on maximum right now. Ooh. Whew. All right, yeah. Looks like they are going to be... Looks like the Panthers are going to be starting around the 26-27 yard line. Two 
two minutes and one second left. Yeah. Barely over two minutes left. Band playing some great music tonight. Mm-hmm. The crowd super happy about the Broncos winning. Oh, smiles all around. Oh, yeah. Smiles all around. Cheerleaders extremely happy as well. These football players playing a really good game tonight. Great, great final home game. Mm -hmm. Great performance from both teams, too. Gotta say, great performance from both teams. Definitely. But yeah, these Broncos just been doing best they can. And I just, I'd like to see this in more games, you know? Mm -hmm. Oh, looks like they're starting on the 20. Ooh, Ooh Panthers out. going in for a, oh! Incomplete flag, flag on, on play. play. I think that was on the Broncos because he never turned back to look at the ball. Yeah. So, yeah, Aiden, he he did not look back. He kept his eyes on the... Uh, yep, he kept his eyes on the, uh, on the player instead of the ball, so that would give them a first down. Wow. Mm-hmm. That's... That is a... Very, very, very easy mistake to fix. Costly penalty. Yes, it is an easy mistake to fix, but it is very costly. Because that could change the tide of a game very quickly if it was a little earlier. Yeah. Yeah, a little yeah, early. A little Not early. now, yeah. obviously. <laughs> but a little earlier, that would have changed the tide so of the game a lot. they it out now. Yeah. That was almost an uh, interception from the Broncos. But still, unfortunately, that was an incomplete pass. And the Panthers will be heading back to where they started. Mm -hmm. Second. Second and ten. Clock winding down. Well, not winding down. It stopped. Yeah. 147. 38 to 16. Great night. Yeah. Panthers are giving it everything they have to push through the Broncos defense, but they are still not able to go through. The Broncos have just been able to hold up. They've been able to close those gaps again. And so I think that the Panthers are just... They're not going to get anything from it. It's just going to be a defense game. Yep. Timeout. Oh. Uh, gateway. Or player is. Ooh. Yeah, there seems to be an injury timeout on field here. And after that penalty timeout, he's doing all right, and he is walking off field. Great to see you walk off the field. Yep. And it looks like everything is heading back. One minute, 20 seconds left. Let's see. Are these Panthers able to get a first down? Nope. Looks like it's going to be a fourth and six. With a minute and five seconds left. Yeah, minute and five seconds. Not too much time. And it's 
Ooh, a timeout from the Panthers. <laughs> Is that their final timeout? I believe their final timeout. Yeah. But yeah, if, if you were Coach George right now, and you were as happy as he is with this win that the Broncos achieved, what would you be telling your team? Just keep it to the next game. Yeah. Take what they used in this game and but bring it over to the next one? Celebrate tonight. Yeah. A great win. A, a great win to close out your home of the season. <laughs> Your home game of the season. Yeah. <laughs> last home game of the season. Yeah. Last home Ended game on of the a, season. A great win. So at home, the Broncos are 2-1. and one. Yeah. With their yeah. other win coming against Liberty. And yep. their loss coming against, coming against Auburndale. Yeah. But still, 2 out of 1 for home games is very good for us. Great job. Yeah, great job to our Broncos out there tonight for doing extremely well. <laughs> All right, the Broncos picking up their defense. Ooh. 55 seconds left. Turnover or flag on the play. Oh, yeah. Let's see what this flag is about and who got it. Flag on the Broncos. Yep. Some sportsman like conduct on our Broncos? Yeah, there's a flag on our Broncos. Mm. Oh. That's going to give them a first down with that penalty. Must have been a five yard penalty. Yep. So, the Panthers will have a first down with just under a minute left. Just find something to bring to the next game. Yep. The 47-yard line, starting off the Panthers. Oh, actually, it looks like they're starting on... 47. No. They're starting on the 38th. Oh. Yeah, they're starting on the 38th yard line with the first and 10. My bad. Yeah. For the Broncos, this is going to be an amazing night for them. Great one. Yep. For the Panthers, I would say, yeah, thank you guys for, you know, coming out here and playing with our team, you know? This is a great game from both teams, though. Oh, yes. Easily. It was also a very entertaining game, too. Mm -hmm. Definitely. A lot of things happening at once. A lot of flags, too. That definitely made the game a lot more interesting with how we had so many flags in the first and second uh, quarter. But in the third and fourth, those flags have almost seemingly kind of disappeared. Clock is winding down. Yep. 16 seconds left in the game. All right, five seconds left, everyone. Great win yep. from the Broncos. An amazing win from our Broncos. Amazing. Well, that'll do it for tonight's broadcast of the Davenport Broncos versus the Gateway Panthers. Broncos won 38-16 to at the ranch. The final home game. I'm Aiden Bulleran. I'm Spencer Schofield. Good night. Yeah, good night, everyone.